I'm alive. Well, shit. Beautiful fire. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Shit. Running. Well, shit. <laughs> I'm alive. Running, running. I'm alive. Shit. I'm gonna hit you with my pickaxe And I'm gonna kill you once And I'm gonna steal your stuff Then I'm gonna go home And I'm gonna eat some peanuts <gasps> No, 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 no No, no, no. <sighs> Stop using spells In a melee combat situation Stop using that, nobody loves you bishop Don't you see, all your students Are dead All of them They're under the ground Dead Cold as the cold wind. Now I'm gonna firebolt your pretty inquisition ass. Yes, do you like that? Do you like that? Oh, you're trying to use spells, but I'm gonna dodge. Pew! Just like that. Did you see that skill? Did you see those techniques? One more time. Oh, I have no mana. Okay, I have just one more shot. I'm at a safe distance, drinking two potions, preparing my stuff, and I'm gonna hit you with my fire tools. Come on, give me the perfect... Oh. That was... No! No! Dodge! Please! Dodge! 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 Oh! Come on! Come on! Now I'm gonna turn and use my cool spell on your face! Yeah! Let me see here. Two more hits. You do realize that I just need two more hits. And you'll be dead. You go down! That's the victory sound, you know? I should find a better one. Get the book, get the book. You see, with this book, he managed to revive all the skeletons. So we're gonna confiscate it. Put it in the pocket. Come on, get it. <gasps> it's too heavy. Got more points to spend. No, 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 no. Tomb of Hades. <gasps> Ooh, wait a second. Hades was some kind of Greek god of Inferno. Of the dark places, of evil things. Let me see. What did what did we confiscate from you? What was all the goody goodies you just gave us? Tomb of Hades. The Tomb of Hades is a legendary book said to be the source of great magical power. The tomb itself seems to be impossible to open. It is closed with a thick glass that has no lock, symbol, or other signs of being opened. The tomb has been in the possession of Bishop Morton for a century. Though he seems to have discovered some of its secrets, the book remains closed. Weighs ten pounds. <gasps> You're much heavier than the others. The Staff of Law. The fabled Staff of Law. The Scepter of Harbinger. The Key to the Hex. And the Awakening of Malkut. The Hex Keeper. Ooh, he has healed Fireball. Bum, bum, bum. And let me see something. It heals, and it takes no mana. Am I right? It takes no mana! I'm gonna heal myself constantly. No one will stop me. And I have fireballs! Let me try something. Damn! One more time, one more time. I want, I want, I want to try something. Come here! Come here! <laughs> okay, wait a second. Bishop Morton, I may have killed you, but I still have questions that need answers. Tell me how to open the Tomb of Hades. My spirit has at last given up to the aged flesh. See, it withers and dwindles, reclaiming the years of shadow. At last, the dark veil is lifted from my eyes. The tomb and star. Oh, you want me to talk all fancy like that? Okay, I can try. Mighty Bishop Morton, teacher of the Church of Wisdom, enlighten me and tell me about your knowledge of the Hex. 
The greatest hex is that of Harbinger. It is said to be located to the east of here, just this side of the river. Only a select few know its true location. Guardians of light who Harbinger charge to watch for the return of evil. Hmm, so I will fight these guardians eventually. Staff. The staff was entrusted to me by Tamaran, the apprentice of Harbinger. It is the one item that can unlock the hex, and even in my madness I kept my vow to stop it falling into the hands of true evil. There is a greater darkness than what I became at work in the world. Oh. Okay. Again, thank you for releasing me. I go to the well with the consolation that even in the depths of my madness, I did not betray the trust of the warlocks. The tomb, staff, and hex still remain hidden from the true evil. Hmm. Wait a second. You want to say that you were not a bad guy? You were just corrupted by the staff? Or maybe the tomb? Or maybe both of those? Doesn't matter. Now I am in possession of those two elements. And maybe I will be drawn to madness. I'll be, I become, I'll gonna, ta -ta -ta. I, I'm gonna become crazy. That's not something new. Everybody knows that. You see all these weapons. I'm gonna come here later, off camera, and collect everything, and then just show you how I sell everything to make money. So we can buy cool things. Like those boots and helm and stuff. Come on, give me the gold. gold. Take the gold, then we can go home and eat some pizza. Right now I'm just gonna speed up and just let you see the whole journey from the Temple of Shadows, from the heart of the Temple of Shadows, back to Madrigal. Why? I don't know, but I think it will be nice. I should buy a backpack. You see, I don't have no backpacks. I have, I only have those mini sacks near my waist, just like some kind of Batman's belt. And I, there I put all my stuff. But I should buy a backpack. That's more efficient. Now wait. Okay, so now we can go back to Uncle Andrews and tell him that we managed to kill Bishop Morton. Even though that was not our quest. Our quest was just to come here and learn new spells. We didn't learn anything, but at least we killed a lot of zombies and skeletons, and we freed that girl named Elizabeth, and we killed Bishop Morton and just stole the Tomb of Hades and the Staff of Law. Maybe our uncle knows how to open the tomb. The Tomb of Hades. Because he has a lot of experience, you know, he's old and he has a lot of knowledge and he's smarter than us. Or maybe he can ask those spirits of the tower to enlighten him once again. Even though I kind of went to the tower and I killed everything that uh, was moving. And now the tower is kind of deserted. Because I've killed everything. Yep. Sorry. But but they started it. They, they jumped on me. And I... That was self-defense. Yep. If they get angry, that was just self-defense. And uh, I deserve another chance, okay? Don't be harsh. Hello lad, welcome, welcome. Grab an ale and join us. We don't get the chance for celebration every day. The stone and the festival are part of Madrigal's heritage, lad. A time when we welcome the spring, if we ever get one, that is. For now, we're thankful our friends are returned. What better reason is there for an ale or two? So what is the ceremony? Just walk up to the stone and make a wish. Wish well, youngster. Wish well. Just make a wish? Yes. Aye. Simple enough, lad. Okay. Bye bye, Bartolego. You jerk. Okay, I wish. Uh, oh. Man, what did you wish for? 
Welcome back, Soulbringer. It is good to see you again after so many years. The Hex awakens once more. What is this place? Ah, you do not remember after so many lifetimes. This is your castle, the Hex, and I am Malkuth, living embodiment of the Staff of Law and Keeper of this place. It was here we planned the downfall of the League of Six so many years ago, and it is here we shall do so again. God. This place is so cool. I, I'm not going in. I'm not going in that room. That's for sure. Welcome home, Soulbringer. What assistance do you need? Um. Tell me about the Hexstone. The Hexstone is the only means of travel to and from the Hex. You can travel back to the world of men to any hex stone. However, many of the stones have lost their link to this realm. You must seek them out and touch them to reaffirm their connection. With the heart of King Kathra, you can also travel to many other realms, not just the mortal realm. The heart rests in Talendra to the south. The symbol on the ground shows your mastery of each element. When you have achieved complete mastery, you will see the symbol change. You can see your progress if you look within at your Seculorum. The laboratory is Kaldos, the greatest alchemist of Talendra. He can reproduce any portion he has seen or heard without need of ingredients. The skull of alchemy is required to entice Kaldor's spirit to help you. With the skull of alchemy placed within the laboratory, Kaldor will be eager to help you. The library is where all your magics are kept. They are arranged by Jard one of the greatest minds of the Thardolin Empire. You must seek the Tome of Hades before Jard can help you. I will take the Tome from you and place it in its proper place. See? Jard's spirit forms! That is my chamber, where I am when you are not here. I can keep any item you wish there for you. You can send items to me simply by making the sign of the over the item. Wherever you are in the world, that item shall immediately come into my possession. I shall await your return here. Ooh, what are you? You are the Seculorum. This must be fire, spirits, air, earth, and water. Yep, that's okay. Perfect, that's perfect. Okay, Malkut, I'm gonna go now. Thanks for everything. Keep this place... Keep keep this place safe. I'll be going. How, would, how do I use this? Uh, okay. I just touch it, and then I vanish. And I can go to Hexor. Ooh, look at this map. What's this? So this is magical. And look, there's a mini pyramid there. So that means every single pyramid, it's another village. And no, these are not the Illuminati, don't be ridiculous. Teleportation! Woo! Hello! Everybody left. Where's the party? Where's the wenches? Where's the drinking and celebrating? For how long was I missing? Woo! You tell me. I'm very curious. Maybe everybody went to f went looking for me. Maybe they are worried sick. I'm such a, such an irresponsible person. Well, she doesn't give a damn about me. Let's go to Hammer. Hammer time. So we can sell everything. And repair our 
worn armor. Hello. Hello, lad. Chance stopped here before he left. Said he was off to Shadow Guard, something about a guild. He said to give you this, and that he'd be waiting for you there. You'd best be tooling up before you head off. Uh, okay, okay, thanks. Ah, the Anvil of Horath. Yep. It is a thing of legend amongst my trade, lad. The finest achievement of the Horath Empire. Back home, they call this place Horath. But it isn't here. Perhaps the ranger knows something. Uh, yeah, maybe. Until next time, lad. Walk well. But uh, the ranger, also known as Chance, he, you, you just told me he left and went to Shadowguard. So I can't actually talk to him right now. And his expertise will help me with nothing. What are you doing with your hands? Are you stretching? Let's talk about something. Ah, greetings to our new lord. Huh? As keeper of the hex, the stone has chosen you as our protector. Oh. Oh. Okay. Can you tell me about the anvil? Ah, yes. It is said that after Harbinger's disappearance, the anvil was taken by the enchanters of Horath, and that the weapons and armor they forged created much of their fabled wealth. Perhaps it still rests there, beyond the Path of Shadows. Hmm. I see. I can, I can send you these. Ta-da! <gasps> and I have enough gold. I have enough gold. Let's buy this. Book of Cloaks. Or Book of Knives. Book of Cloaks. Or Book of Knives. Or Book of Cloaks. Hmm, I, I need both of those. Look, these are with magics. Should I buy it? Yes, yeah, I'm so broke, I can't even afford to eat an apple. <laughs> then return soon, sire. Okay, no problem. <gasps> Wait a second, I forgot to... No, I forgot to ask you something. Shadow Guard, what's the greatest port in the Horath Empire? Tales say trade ships from Thardalin and Talendra were seen in its ports every day. But it has been many centuries since the dragon soldiers were seen in these lands. Dragon soldiers? Well. Then return soon, sire. Uh, you don't have to be all that formal with me, sire. Come on, we're old buddies. We're good old chaps. You know, when we were doing quests together, where you were actually just sitting in your nice office now, doing all the dirty work and fighting. But still, we, 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 should, we should remain at some point of equality. You know, I don't, I don't want to feel like all mighty and stuff. We are, we, are, we are pals, we are friends, we are... Oh, seriously, you just crashed the game. How could you? I was just trying to be nice with you. I was trying to show you that I respect you, and you crashed the game. Did you miss me? Be honest. Hello. So, you managed to find your way back from wherever you vanished to, then? I'm sorry, I don't have anything right now. Nothing you'd want to dirty your hands with anyway. Hmm. Oh, you're talking about cleaning dishes up. Try not to do any mysterious vanishing again in the near future. It scares some of the more impressionable folk. You had us all worried with your disappearing act. Glad to see you. You're all in one piece. Everyone is talking about your disappearance at the festival. Yeah, I know. That's kind of un un unusual. Chant has gone back to his home in the east. He must be getting bored with you cleaning up all the problems. Barthelago fled town the night of the festival. No one knows where he went. Elric and Hammer have been really worried of late. Something about an ancient treaty between two old empires. Sorry, lover. The only talk I've heard recently is about you. You're nice and all, but it's not my place to be flirting with a warlock. Be careful out there. It'd be a shame if anything happened to you. Why did she call me a warlock? I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm similar to a fire mage because I, I, the only thing I used was fireball, 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 fireball. And a little mineral shield. Or, or, and maybe I recollect spirits a couple of times. But that, that's, that's, you know, normal routine. 
I usually talk to spirits because I don't have real friends, so I, I'm, I'm just like that Yoha Sakura guy from the Shaman Kings. I just, I just talk to spirits, but I don't go into cemeteries because that kind of, that, that's kind of creepy. Okay, let's go to Alfonso to see how he's ruling his kingdom. Maybe he can give us some apples and fishes to replenish our supplies. Let us talk business. You have a very wonderful and beautiful shop. I do like how you keep this place tidy up and nice, you know? Looking for something in particular, my lord? That old coat's gone, and good riddance too, I say. I heard Alice say that he'd took off for the night of the festival, packed up and left, and took everything with him. I heard he's headed off up north across the river. Alice said Shadow Guard or something. Well, I dare say he's up to no good, wherever he's gone. All items at discount, sir, for everything you've done for me. <laughs> no problem, but I didn't actually do anything for you, I just... Okay, I can buy... I don't have enough money to buy anything. Now I have zero gold. I'm the poorest warlock in this freaking village. Can I sell something? I can sell that cloak that I didn't use. Oh, I can sell the wine and buy two fishy fishes. Yep, that's perfect. I'm still broke. <laughs> Sad. Do come again. Always a pleasure. Teleporting magical town square. Bum, 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 bum. Everybody's like, my lord, my sire, my almighty pajama man. But I'm broke as Coco. I don't have money even to buy food. I have three, four, five, fi four fishes. Okay, that's nice. There are six. There are six. Why did I say five? Yeah, people think I'm an idiot. I don't know how to count. Okay, let's go to our uncle. So, Berthelago and Chant, they both left Madrigal and went to Shadowguard, right in the night of the festival. That's strange. Okay, let's go and uh, tell our uncle the great news. Uh, well, I can't really show him the staff floor because uh, Malkut just transformed into a human and he's guarding the hex, so I can't show him that. And I can't even show the Book of Hades because Jard appeared in the library and uh, he took the book. And um, I kind of can't show him anything, and he'll he'll think I'm lying. And what the? Uncle, oh, Uncle Andrus. <gasps> master, I have sent my Raal searching many roads for you. You killed my uncle! Indeed. I am Tamaran, third of the Fourth Seekers and disciple of Skull. I shall be the one to take you to Galdon 4 and destroy the last vestiges 